Hello, my name is Tom Stiles, and this is Tom's Radio Room Show number 259. At least I think it is. What I was experimenting with tonight was one of the hidden features of this Texan PL-80. And the reason I say it's hidden is because there's nothing in the manual about it. But it obviously has this feature. And it, what it is, is synchronous detection. And a, kind of a very simple description of synchronous detection is it's a circuitry that attempts to work on the signal, shortwave in this case, and try to equalize it, I'll call it, in that if you have a signal that's fading in and out. It tries to introduce a solid carrier into that reception so that you get rid of that in and out fading. Now I don't use that feature very much and where I believe it first came about is uh, the Sony shortwave radios were the first one that had the synchronous detection. And I have one of those older Sony radios, and the synchronous detection worked pretty good. And it would take a signal that was fading in and out and lock it in so that it was nice and smooth and constant amplitude. So I've got a signal here. I think it's the voice of Turkey at 5.960. And if you can see it, let me try zooming a little bit with my camera. As you, if you can see it, this meter up here, which is in dBm, the signal in the uh, tickle to noise ratio, is varying quite a bit. Well, not a lot, but it's varying. It's not steady. Now, let me turn up the sound although it's music so I have to be a little careful but it's not anything that anybody would recognize I think so you can you can hear it's it's fading in and out now I'll use the secret key which is to push and hold either the USB button, I mean the upper side bound button or the lower side bound button. And if you push it and hold that, you'll see it'll go into the sync mode here. So here we go. There it goes. It's going into the mode. Now it says upper side band sync. If you can see that. Zoom in a little more. Turn that sound down. It's probably not uh, in focus, but trust me. So now I'm going to see what it sounds like compared to what it did sound like. Terrible. Listen to that garble. So that's, that's made it worse. Now, <laughs> granted, I'm no expert on how this should work, and also granted that that feature was not documented even though the predecessor to this Texan PL-80 the 660 had that feature okay so let's try it again we'll go back first take it out of sync back in norm It actually doesn't sound that bad, but you can definitely hear that it's wavering, I'll call it. Now we'll try lower sideband sync. So I have to push and hold the LSB button until I see it go into sync mode, which it just did. It's locking on. It's locked on now. There. See, it, it does pretty good there, and then all of a sudden it gets that warble sound, and it's really bad. Now let's look at the numbers here. 
it's it's only changing from 46 to 47. And actually, there's a 48. Pretty constant. And there's a 49. So it's, I'm guessing it's searching to try to tune that frequency in and hold it in, lock it on. So let's turn it off. So now it's normal mode. Signal level jumps up, but it's also moving around quite a bit. So it's going from 47 to 53 now. But I don't, I don't ever get that wobbly, crazy sound when I'm just in normal joy mode. We'll try it one more time. Upper sideband sync. Synchronous detection is what it's called. Okay, it's starting to sync. It's synced. Now, Ooh. Hear that? So, granted this was a test of one, but it appears that the AM synchronous detection mode on the PL880 is not working correctly. Not working correctly at all. And uh, like I say, I have a Sony radio. It's quite old. It's probably, oh gosh, 20 years old. Um, it's one of the first radios that came out with a synchronous detection. And it worked pretty good. Compared to this, it worked real good. But this, this is not working at all. So I just thought I'd try that and see how it worked out. Apparently, we got another strike against the uh, PL880. Unless I'm doing something wrong. Now, I could be doing something wrong. Maybe I've... Some other functions I've got to adjust to make this work properly, but I don't know what it would be. If you have any suggestions, please let me know. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.